We've located a Hydra agent with an unusually high gamma signature, probably from working in close proximity to their recent experiments. that agent, we might gain some insight into Hydra's plans. Let's get started. Regain their bearings. Excellent work. But I doubt Hydra will let you walk off with their agents so easily. Stay alert. We need to take care of the rest of these thugs. Don't hold back! You have earned this! Time has come. Hail that. The advantage is mine.
must break you. Submit. Persistence is going to get you hurt. I can. You're set on coming after me. Let's try this. Trick. Want it done right? Gotta do it yourself. This shall be of great help. by your weakness. No. I need a stretcher here. You have nothing to fear. Yours.
to try that. Looks like I'm all by my lungs. All Hydra knows how to do is bleed. Think I was done, did you? The light is on our side. See if they have an answer for this. Fear the Scarlet Witch. I'm glad someone was watching my back. Well, Granny hit harder than that. Too weak for this fight. Looks like you've got the agent in custody. Better clear out before Hydra sends a search party. So, don't get mad, but Caretaker wants to run emo kids tonight. I do not mind. Why would that make me mad? I I'm a little mad. I don't want her thinking she's in charge now. Alright, let's do this. Lead the way. How much did Nico tell you about tonight's meeting? She said you are leading it. I suspect you have an opinion on the matter. Say what you must. I am ready. That's all? Yes. When do we start? As soon as you want. Tonight I will cocoon your conscious mind from your past self. When you are ready, we can safely observe the events of your death. Is this some kind of hypnosis? No, it's old magic. Once used to heal tormented minds, it allows one to observe and process past events that may be painful to consider. Why didn't you think of this sooner? You've been gone so long. Until the last meeting, it didn't occur to me that the events of your death are, to you, quite recent. Now then, shall we proceed? We can begin. What is the last memory on the night of your death? Lilith, asking me to join her. Keep it close. That's where you'll begin. All right. What do you see? Lilith and I face each other in the circle. Join you? Why would I ever do that? Since my transformation, I have made so many children. 
Yet all pale beside my greatest creation. My true child. Perfect. Conceived in my very image. I am nothing like you. Not yet. But you will be. When I remove the shackles that bind no. you. I will never stand by your side. Foolish child. You have no choice in the... But we can no longer afford such lies. I cannot move. The Darkhold. She has the Darkhold. You cling to the delusions of your captors. Embrace your true self trapped within. She lifts the Darkhold high. She... That's it? That's how the Hunter died? There's nothing more. So the Hunter died because of... a book? Miss Rasputin, the Darkhold is hardly a book. So Lilith read the Hunter to death. I guess she channeled her demon powers through the Darkhold. Ugh, still a boring way to die. What did Lilith mean about your true self? We are finding more questions than answers. True, but we have someone here who can help decipher them. Sarah knows her sister better than anyone alive. Perhaps she has insight on what Lilith meant. I will talk to Sarah. Sounds good. That's all we had. You taking off? In a minute. Let me know when you're heading out. Observing your own death can lead to sleepless nights, I know from personal experience. If you have trouble sleeping, I can write you a prescription. A joke, of course. I'm not licensed in this state. You died predictably. You sound disappointed. Death for the Hunter should not be so banal. Next time, add some spice. Get your legs stuck in a combine harvester. Have a sack of starving weasels tied around your face. Anything but demon powers. I'm disappointed. I thought there'd be more to it. Same here. I always thought her attack on the Abbey was to recover the Darkhold, but it appears it was a means to an end. What she said about me, my true self, can you explain that? No, it's nonsense, but she clearly believed what she said. Perhaps we can use this against her. How? When we're ready to face her, you may be able to divert her attention. You want to use me as bait? Well, if you're offering. Why is using me as bait always your plan? Because it works. After I died, was that how you found me? Yes. You and Lilith. With the dark hold between you. If she used it to kill me, how did she die? The Darkhold is a dangerous book. Maybe the power was too much for her to control. I know where my body ended up. What of Lilith? The Knights of Wondergore took Lilith's body. I didn't ask where, and didn't want to know. And the Darkhold? Also provided to the Knights, in pieces for them to scatter throughout the world. It worked for centuries, until Hydra tracked them down. That is all I wanted to ask. Are you... all right? This can't have been easy to relive. Not knowing was the hardest part of my return. I feel... better. Good. I won't keep you. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Another meeting completed. You heading out? That is it for me. Sounds good. See you next meeting.
tension so thick I could claw it to shreds. Something or someone is going to snap. Did you hear Tony and Strange arguing? Who's next? Parker and Nico? Seen good troops lose their minds not knowing if a tank was going to mortar their bunkers, but seeing seasoned enhanced heroes walking on eggshells is a new kind of unsettling. This place makes my skin crawl. We could do something else. I meant the Abbey. The air always feels wrong here. Makes my hair stand on end. It is part of the Abbey's charm. Wouldn't call that charming. I meant the actual charm built into the Abbey. It encourages you to leave. How long until that stops? For a person? You get used to it after a few years. Well, I don't plan on being around that long. That's something I can use. Are you finally beginning to understand now? Family protects one another. Family loves one another. Family would do anything to save one another. Is that not what these heroes of yours preach? Then why abandon you at the doorstep of that wretched pretender Mephisto, my precious child? My family saved me. It was the coward Blaze that sold me out. Perhaps. Still, Blaze is no coward. And he is most certainly not a friend to Mephisto. For him to have made such a deal, all the more reason I must have the page. I knew you were going to go there. Hear me, child. Say what you will about Johnny Blaze. But his soul is one of the strongest I have ever encountered. He has carried the parchment for decades without succumbing to its call, battled angels and demons alike, and rattled the thrones of far too many gods. It almost seems like you admire him. I simply state the facts. Now he is free of the page, and another takes on the mantle of its guardian. Robbie. Do you really think he will prevail over the parchment of power? You were right, Mother. I am? Robbie will never be Johnny Blaze. He will become something far greater. I gladly place my fate and that of the world in his hands. My original offer still stands. If you truly value your friend, Relieve him of his burden and surrender the parchment to me. Ignore my warning, 
And Blaze's betrayal will be a fond memory compared to what is coming next. I hope the others slept better than I did. That can't be. I had that dream too. Maybe it was something we ate. Don't you mean someone? Hmm, I don't know. This stinks of a hex or a curse or something. If we all had the same nightmare, does that mean we all share the same subconscious neuroses? God, I hope not. The probability of every single one of us walking the same dream state is a billion trillion to one. It must mean something. Yeah, it means we might want to have a little chat with our friendly neighborhood hunter. Oh, I knew I should have let Mr. Murdoch copyright that for me. I still can't get that image out of my mind. Same here. And that's saying a lot these days. I'm sure there's a logical explanation for this all. There is... the parchment. I knew that page would find a way of messing with our heads. Or maybe it was warning us about you-know-who. Did you have the dream? What dream? I'm here, if you want to talk about it. I'm assuming you had the same dream last night as the rest of us. I am pretty sure I did not. What was it? I'll let Wanda tell you. She's better at communicating those kinds of things. All I can say is, what I saw last night made me worry about you. I am more worried about you. Riddled with nightmares, suspicious of friends and colleagues. The page is getting to you. The page is not getting to me. Everyone had the same exact nightmare last night. If anything, it's getting to everyone here. It is possible. The full effects of the Parchment of Power have gone largely unstudied. And they will remain unstudied. Honestly, I can't wait for it to be destroyed. So, you were not going to read it? Hell no. And not just because I suspect it's giving me bad dreams. Because I know whatever Blaze read set him off so hard that he betrayed us. The page most likely tricked him into believing the outcome was destined to be in Lilith's favor. And that's why I'm not going to read it. Like, ever. I think Wanda wants to talk to you. I, I should stop monopolizing your time and let her get a word in. Oh, and Hunter? Yes, Robbie? Take care of yourself, okay? Like, really take care. I always do. What is everyone so upset about? A nightmare. We all had the same one last night, and it has unnerved us. Wondering if you had the same one, too. Would be weird if you were the only one in the Abbey who didn't. You mean the one about Lilith? Wait, you had a dream about Lilith? Is that not the one you all had? No, Hunter. We had a dream about you. And it was a pretty awful one, too. What? What about me? Let's just say you... Uh... Something threw you above us. Your face twisted in what could only be described as extreme agony. And that's as far as I want to remember. I don't want to freak you out. I mean, it was just a dream, right? We both know nothing is just a dream, especially these days. Let's hope this one was. 
We should probably stop talking now. Everyone is staring. They are staring? Yep. They really are frightened, are they not? Hey, if it makes you feel any better, everyone here is just as afraid of me as they are of you. The parchment's days are numbered, Hunter. Come down to the forge. I just wanted to say I appreciate you leaning on me out there in the field, but I feel you deserve fair warning. Associating with me too much can be hazardous to your health. Hazardous? What do you mean? I mean Sabretooth. He's killed everyone I've ever been close to. Girlfriends, co-workers, casual pals. He even killed my mail carrier. This Sabretooth seems to have an unhealthy obsession with you. He's obsessed with misery. And inflicting it on me and anyone who comes close to me. Nothing scares me much these days. Except getting close to people. Because when I get close to someone, bad things tend to happen to them. So, I guess what I'm saying is, thanks for being a pal. And watch your back. Good. I was hoping for something to do. our minds, right? Because that dream was too real. Maybe I shouldn't be so gung-ho about you confronting Lilith. Sending your friends out to fight isn't the easiest choice, but we all know what we signed up for. You and Lilith was not the worst nightmare I've ever had, but I am still unsettled by it. myself awake and just thank the staff of one of us many a dream. You would never side with Lilith against us, right, Hunter? I, I I feel bad for even asking that. Never mind. Don't answer. I don't care what the even a sword. Ready for more? You better not sell it out to your mother, Hunter. I'd be disappointed. Dream, but... But last night I felt like I couldn't wake up. I still say we should have built a firing range first. and our minds because she is desperate. Come on over, Hunter. I'm slinging some hot, fresh, parchment-blasting tech here. Is this it? Is this the thing that will destroy the parchment? You better believe it. That's the Gamma Accelerator. Plus a few tips taken from dear old Dad's notes. Plus a few crucial adjustments. Plus some revolutionary new tech created on the fly. Are you sure it will work? I'm sure you've got a million questions. Come to the war room and you can hear my full spiel. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. Oh, you are gonna love this. That said, something still isn't quite making sense. The whole picture is fuzzy. We are missing something. It was all a... I'm... Tr Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony. I'm a sister today. Sometimes, I even impress myself. I feel like I could automate this process.
What are we building today? This forge fire is something special. Best work, but it'll do. Later. Any time now, Tony. Yeah, you're being a little extra you right now. Forgive me if I'm a little ex... Just tell me what I need to do to make this plan happen. Seems like everyone had a restless night. I hate to ask this, but are you all right? Why? Do I look like there is something wrong with me? No, not at this moment, but the dream, I mean, nightmare we all had of you. The one everyone had, but no one will tell me about? Let's just say you should be grateful to have your collar to protect you. Protect me from what, exactly? Your mother, Hunter. Who else? If it wasn't for that collar, who knows how she might be able to manipulate you. I wouldn't put it past her to invade your dreams, the way I think she just invaded ours last night. Do you really think she can manipulate us through our dreams? Even in this protected pocket dimension? Anything is possible. In any case, best to keep our wits about us. I just don't want anything to happen to you, kiddo. Uh-huh. What's the plan? No, uh-uh, not yet. Only reason to listen to Tony is to get directions to the rap party. You believe the cause is lost? Didn't say that. Did not say that either. I've seen the world end a few times, and I'm still here to talk about it. That is not saying much. You have a healing factor. We can't all be born as unlucky as me. Lilith has marked us all. I am tempted to say our fate is in her hands. Fate. The other F word. Scoff if you would like. Lilith believes in destiny. The problem is, we believe in our own destinies, too. You sound like Steve. My words are my own, not Captain America's or Lilith's. Steve's a good thing. Especially with what we gotta do. One thing we can agree on, hell ain't coming. Hell is already here. Weird dreams, huh? Probably just the end of the world jitters. I don't like to say that I do my best work under pressure, but I think this time, I even amazed myself. This is impressive. You did this work incredibly fast. Chug a few Stark drives and there's nothing you can't speed through. Hopefully the sugar crash doesn't hit me while we're destroying the page. If you manage to stop the prophecy, I will be the first to sing your praises. So you're promising karaoke. I'm gonna hold you to that, Hunter. This thing won't fail. What about your father's research? Do you feel comfortable using it as the basis for this canon? I'm only perfecting the stuff he started. It's like I took all the skeletons out of my family closet, dusted them off, and now they're going to do community service. It is powered by skeletons. Don't worry. Figure of speech. No actual skeletons in there, just massive amounts of gamma radiation. Our friend Banner thought he was going to use it to get supercharged. But this thing's gonna shut his team down, permanently. Let us keep our attention on destroying the parchment. We can deal with Hulk after. Oh, come on! I know multitasking probably wasn't a thing in your olden times, but it's the only way I get stuff done. Plus, I can't get Banner out of my mind. So... what now? Now comes the hard part. 
explaining my plan to the team. I wonder if I have time to whip up some diagrams. People love diagrams. I know we can't control our dreams, Hunter. Maybe we can help you learn not to share them. I don't like these apocalypse willies. I don't think the others have any nerves left to fray. We're ready to make a move. This is definitely the coziest war room I've ever been in. Quiet, too. Once, I dreamt that I grew four more arms after the radioactive... Then I also grew mouth pincers. I even turned into a... Just wanted to say I appreciate you leaning on me out there in the hazardous. I mean, this saber tooth seems to have an unhealthy. <laughs> no, that can't be. I had that. I must. I. What is it? The parchment's days are numbered, Hunter. Come down to the forge. Once, I dreamt that I grew four more arms after the radioactive spider bite. Let's address the spooky elephant in the room. Dreams are... Let's do this. A light sleeper. But last night I felt like I couldn't wake up. Coffee makes the bad dreams go away. What's new, Hunter? We'll cut through that encryption in no time. Really good intel here. I shouldn't be so gung-ho about you confronting Lilith. Lilith's messing with our minds, right? Because that dream was too real. Friendly neighborhood service at friendly neighborhood prices. I know we can't... Come on over, Hunter. I'm slinging some hot, fresh parchment blasting tech here. Oh, you are gonna love this. Last night was no. Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony, and how many sisters there? It was all a dream, right, Hunter? Next time, could you dream of anything else? I'll even take one of those dreams where. I'm trying to assume it was Lilith in all our hands. These apocalypse willies. Any time now, Tony. Yeah, you're being a little extra you right now. Well, forgive me if I'm a little excited that another one of my brilliant, one-of-a-kind inventions will thwart the apocalypse. Again. 
Uh huh. What's the plan? No, uh uh, not yet. Waiting until we have a quorum. Don't want to have to explain the complex calculations, algorithms, and other assorted science bits twice. The Forge Demon was right. You do love the sound of your own voice. See? I don't like to say that I do my best work. I wonder if I have time to whip up some diagrams. People love diagrams. I don't remember signing up for the Dream Sharing Club. How do I unsubscribe? My shirt. Too bad you had to die for it. Robbie knows the Parchment of Power's got nothing on him. We could have set up shop at my place in the city. It's not as creepy, but at least the taco place delivers. You and Lilith was not the worst nightmare I've ever had. But I am still unsettled by it. Weird. Now, I know a lot of you aren't used to the scientific method. So, take a breath, let it all soak in. I can talk you through the really complex parts. You want to shoot the indestructible page with a giant ray gun? A giant gamma ray gun. You can't just blow up the parchment of power with gamma energy, it isn't done. He has a point. Look, you and the Hocus Pocus crowd had your shot. Now, it's my turn. Mine and Howard's. Your father's research. Pops wasn't trying to weaponize gamma energy. He was trying to supercharge it into an almost unlimited power source. Should probably thank Bruce for helping me realize that. Problem is, gamma energy has a threshold. Push it too much and it goes boom, big time. Enter Los Diablos. Birthplace of the Hulk. And the last time somebody tried putting Pop's theories to the test, entire area is still saturated with that same modified energy. If I can channel it through my accelerator cannon, well, that gamma field page of yours will go boom, big time. Bingo. Huge time. We're gonna need a tremendous amount of power. And not just Gamma. Yo, Lost Boys. And Lost Girls, saddle up. We need you. Sabretooth's still out there. They ain't going nowhere without me. The more the better. Somebody's gotta clap when I thwart the apocalypse again. Focused on Tony's ridiculous plan. I'll keep an eye out for Hydra. Your enthusiasm is infectious, Sarah. I'm allowing this to move forward, aren't I? Anyway, Robbie and Tony are already in place. Good luck. We all need it. Certifiable. So it's not just me. Wait, I. What's the word, kid? Nothing. Nothing is definitely the word. Oh, well, nothing's good. You don't have the Abbey masking you in that page right now. Just keep a safe distance a little longer until we're ready here. With even one blast, my gamma cannon will drain the ambient gamma energy from this entire valley. This is gonna have to be a one-shot deal. Then don't miss. <laughs> Got that part, Kevlar. By far the worst plan I've ever been part of. And I've done jobs with Deadpool. Robbie cannot hide that page forever. If there is any chance of removing that burden from him. Huh. Speaking of. Yo, fast in the flamius. What did I just tell you? Stark! Power up that damn ray gun! What? Stark! Multiple targets! 
Bandits, close it on your position! That ain't Robbie. Activated gamma collectors now. How long do you need? How would I know? I just invented the damn things yesterday. Then keep going. We will hold the line. Stark. Too smart for your own good. Ignore the others and follow that page. It's time I return home. from attacking the highly volatile Gamma Collector, that would be fantastic. Feel free to come down here and throw a few lasers at him. Yeah, sure, no problem. And while I'm down there, which one of you is going to initialize the accelerator to fire this thing? Fair point. We will hold this position as long as necessary. Trust me, it'll be worth the wait. something. Running into you, Creed. Maybe it's time I cut off your feet. Mother would just give me another pair. You should know that by now, Logan. Tired of hearing about your mama, too. Agreed.
Now it's my turn. I'm gonna rip you a new one. up there, Stark. Getting warmer. Keep fighting. Better not be dragging your feet. How does one drag their feet in the air? I'll explain later, kid. You don't want to get up.
hoping to wear me down. They have not changed their plans. Lilith has put a great deal of trust in your nemesis, Logan. Yeah, she really knows how to pick them. You sound bitter. If only Mother had chosen you, like Logan. I'm nobody's minion. I leave that to suckers like you.
Not looking good for you. Whatever works for you. You're just lucky we aren't allowed to take this life. One of these days, I'm gonna put you down for good. Thought you were supposed to be tough. As they say, it gets the job done. I think we're ready to rock and roll. This mess, you know. What? But y'all had to do things the hard way. <laughs> you were right, kid. I am a coward. Been running from this moment my whole life. World's really gonna beat this thing, it'll need someone strong. Thank you. Other side? The horns are new. That's not all. Through mother's eyes. That sounds a little weird, too. You know that's not enough. I'm saving my energy so I need it. You know what happens when I get angry. This shall be a great help.
There is no escape. Coming back to me. Let us see if they have an answer for this. You're making a mistake. Her fire burns inside me. will try and ride the lightning. We needed a way to destroy the parchment, and I gave us one. Damn if you do. Damn if you do. You see, this guy gets it. It's your time. Time is coming. Not as powerful as Lilith had hoped. Probably thank you for helping me break through, Tony. You don't know how frustrating it's been. I'm sure it was to your advantage keeping me down. Don't get all broody on me now, Bruce. That's just Lilith talking. Assistance. This should be good. Might as well be throwing pointy sticks. How did you ever manage to control him in the past? A control is a strong word. I'd say it's more like we pointed him at something and hoped for the best. That is not reassuring. That will never stop me. You're making a mistake. It's 
nice not being on the receiving end of your wrath. will deliver the page to Lilith, just as it was foretold, just as she planned all along. All right, because you're telling me she orchestrated all of this? My mother always gets what she wants. With the dark hold in her grasp, there is only one thing she is missing. Me. can cross surviving a hawk attack off my list of bucket things I never wanted to experience. Only thing is, magic took out Sabretooth. Now I don't feel like smoking it. Knew one day he'd cut off more than he could chew. I just thought Creed's reckoning was mine to deliver. Magic is too young to have this on her shoulders. I agree. Can't tell Magic what to do, though. Got too much of that Rasputin headstrong nature. It is indeed dark times when the youth must make dark choices. I'm worried about the kid. You change when you cancel someone's check. We can't afford another one on our side pulling a banner. Battle offers us no easy choices, and none of us emerge unscathed. Eliana's grown on me. <laughs> I guess I gotta make sure she doesn't end up like me. Last thing I need is another Jubilee. She could come in handy against Hulk, though. The Hulk situation worries us all. I've survived a few dust-ups of the Green Rage monster. Two reasons I walked away. Healing factor, and I got the feeling that Banner was holding the Green Guy back. I don't get that feeling anymore, do you? Dr. Banner may prove an ally to us. Your mom's play of turning puny Banner was smart. She controls Hulk's only weakness. The part that was on our side. Great, 
She's got some serious game. Hulk and I have tangled before, but it was... Enough, Tony. We tried and we failed. Time to admit we might not have all the answers on this one. We needed to act, and that's exactly what I did. Yeah, okay, the plan didn't work out. I'll come up with another. If that doesn't work, I'll try again, and again. Until I win. You win? <sighs> you know what I meant. I know exactly what you meant. Listen to someone other than yourself for once. Stand down, Tony. Not while I can still fix this. Stand down now. Before we all go down with you. What do you say, boss? Is Rogers right? Should the star player get benched after one mistake? Or maybe you're smart and you know I can get us across the finish line. I have faith in you, Tony. One failed plan will not change that. The Great Hunter has spoken. I knew you'd have my back. Anything else, Rogers? This won't end well. You know what? Write down all of your concerns. Email them to me, and I'll never read them. Hunter, are you any good at writing eulogies? I mean, it's not like Robbie's gonna let you write a eulogy for Blaze. Seems like this is something he's got to work out on his own. But a little backup never hurts. And what are you doing? Me? I'm here to support Robbie. He watched his personal hero sacrifice himself. He shouldn't have to grieve alone. I am concerned about Robbie too. Blaze's betrayal and his sacrifice? It could be overwhelming to him. The guy's been through a lot. That's why I want to help him get closure. I'm sure he'll be fine after that. Closure? What is that? Yeah, you know, um, closure? Like, after you have a breakup and you insist on making your ex go out for coffee so you can tell them how they made you feel. Do you think that is effective? I've watched hundreds of hours of daytime TV talk shows that say yes. So, as soon as Robbie works this out, we'll be good to go. Robbie will figure out what to do. I can't get Blaze out of my head. I don't mean possession or anything, just everything that happened. Tell me what you were thinking. On the one hand, he was my personal hero. On the other hand, he tried to destroy you. On the other, other hand, he sacrificed himself to save me. How do I honor him and still be truthful? It's too many hands. No matter what betrayals he visited upon us, he did the right thing in the end. You were standing here because he sacrificed himself. Maybe so. I also remember Mephisto's sulfur stench and Blaze's generally awful attitude. Can I really talk about the good and ignore the awful? I don't think so. Whatever you decide to do, do it quickly. I am afraid we are running out of time. You really helped clarify my thinking. Thank you. I I'll figure something out by morning. Promise. <sighs> this is so hard. Maybe we should just have a memorial barbecue.
chatter points to blood. I could not have predicted this outcome, but it is intriguing. Got more coil for me? Brought me the good stuff. Sometimes, I have impressed myself. My best work. Until next time. aside, Hydra's never been this active. Hearing about sleeper agents pulling out from all the major three-letter agencies. We could go if you were Practice makes perfect. I find myself wishing Red Skull were still in charge. Hydra hasn't been this active since my Howling Commando days. There's something going on that we're not seeing. See you soon. This tomb won't be that creepy, right? We should bring flashlights. Mm. Guess you overheard our conversation. Some of it. Let's face it, this doomsday scenario might be a little too on the gothy supernatural side for the Avengers. So, it's time for them to move over and let the kids take the reins. While I admit that we may need a change in strategy, I do not see the need to squeeze out the Avengers. It's not like they have any problem stonewalling us whenever they feel like it. Nico, we are all supposed to be working together. Well, maybe this working together stuff doesn't always, you know, work out. Besides, everyone needs a little help now and then. Even the Avengers. So, do you have a plan? You mean, a plan to stop Cathan from serving us all up in his all-you-can-eat cosmic flesh buffet? We don't have all the deets nailed down as of yet, but we'll work it out. Till then, keep this under wraps until we know what we're doing. I don't want to freak out the Avengers any more than they already are. Will do. Cool. Catch up later. Hey guys, I know you probably don't want to hear this, but we need to start stepping up.